Hello everyone, it's story time. Our story for today is our deaf dog Danny. Do you know what deaf means? Deaf means silly. This is written by Pamela Allen. Uncle Peter's house is in the sand hills by the beach. He lives there with his dog, Millie. We love to visit them, even in winter when it's cold. Then we roll up our trousers and chase the waves. Uncle Peter throws the ball for Millie. He can throw a long, long way. Millie always catches it and brings it back. Today, for the first time, we have brought our dog Danny with us. Danny loves the beach too. But when Uncle Peter threw the ball, Danny chased Millie and grabbed her tail. Millie howled and howled, but Danny won't let go. Arf! 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 That means stop in dog language. Poor Millie. She yanked and she yelped. She bounced and she barked. She snarled and she snapped. But Danny won't let go. Uncle Peter shouted, Stop it, naughty dog. Let go. We pulled and pulled, but still, Danny wouldn't let go. Poor Millie. When Danny got tired and did at last let go, Uncle Peter was cross. We're going home, he growled, and don't bring that deaf dog with you ever again. At home, we were miserable. We all wanted the beach to be fun, even Uncle Peter. What could we do? It was Uncle Peter who reached up high and took down a jar of Geoff's hot chili sauce from the top shelf of the kitchen cupboard. This should fix things, he said. Come on. And we set off for the beach again. Uncle Peter held out Millie's tail. I held the jar and Toby smeared the sauce up and down and round and round. When Millie's tail was completely covered in hot chili sauce, Uncle Peter threw the ball. Millie chased it and... Yuck! Yuck! Ew! Yuck! Yuck, 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 yuck! Gowled Danny. Or yowled Danny. He won't do that again, said Toby. We took the howling Danny home for a drink of water. We felt sorry for him. We'd spoiled his game and he was miserable. We wanted Danny to have fun at the beach too. What could we do? In the garden shed, we found some rope. Toby gave the rope to Uncle Peter. What's this for? He asked. Wait and see, I said. It's Toby's good idea. Come on. Then off we went to the beach again. When Uncle Peter saw our new game, he laughed. <laughs> Clever boy, Toby. Then he threw the ball a long, long way. 
Danny grabbed the pretend tail. Look, it's a tug of war, yelled Toby. Come on! Sometimes we won. Sometimes Danny won. And sometimes nobody won. But it didn't matter because now the beach was fun again for all of us. On the way home, Toby asked, Can we bring Danny with us next time we come? What do you think Uncle Peter said? Oh, do you think Uncle Peter said yes? Why? Why do you think that Uncle Peter said no? Oh, right. Well, then the beach is fun for everyone. They just have to be a thinker to solve the problem, right? Well, that's the end of our story, and I hope you liked it. Okay, bye!